Hi, this is Aaron Zola with Zolotech.com, and today I have the new Microsoft Blue Track Explorer mouse. Uh, a lot of sites say it won't go on sale until January. Uh, it's actually available at Best Buy. So they had a deal on it. Normally they're $100. Uh, Black Friday and the Saturday after, I went Saturday and they're $50. I don't know if that's a normal deal, but next they also make a smaller notebook mouse, and that's $80. So. Um, I'm, I currently use Microsoft Mouse. I use a Mac, but I use the Microsoft Mouse. I actually brought a couple for comparison. Um, here's an older one. This is just a, a uh, wheel mouse optical USB. So it's just basically your, your basic mouse. And I brought that to compare. And then this is the um, kind of the last generation of their high-end mice. It's the wireless laser mouse 8000. So I thought we'd take this and uh, see if this is any better. I I'm not really happy with the tracking on the, the 8000, so uh, we'll see if this is good as they say it is. So um, that's pretty much it for packaging. You can see it, it, it does say it comes with a dock to charge, so we'll go ahead and open it. Uh, nicely. It's, it's not one of those nasty blister packs, although it might be. There we go. Well, that was pretty easy. really hard piece of tape. Well, we'll pull these out. Let's see what we've got here. Open that up. Okay. So here we've got the the dock. This is this is for the uh, charging, I guess. There's a port to plug in. Oh, sorry. There's a part to uh, a port to plug in. And this keeps falling apart. So let me show you this. And well, that probably looks a little better. Um, get the installation CD. I don't know if you really need that a whole lot, but maybe for some options. Okay, instruction booklet, uh, product guide. We'll set these aside. Okay. Looks like they gave us a nice battery. Let's pull this out. I get a mess of the packaging, but it doesn't really stay together well. Okay, so it's a uh, nickel metal hydride battery. And there's the adapter. That's, I think that's everything that's in here. Let me look. Yeah. yeah, that's everything that comes in there. So we'll see about pulling the mouse out. Oh, it comes out. Didn't come out quite as nicely. So there's the mouse itself. can see um, the mouse wheel is a little bit different than the past plasticky rubbery mouse ball or mouse uh, wheels mouse balls from uh, the Mac mouse I'm kind of used to uh, on the bottom you can see the two charging ports here and here uh, this is the spot where you put your your USB uh, wireless adapter here's the, the new uh, blue track you can't really see, it doesn't look like your traditional mouse, but it, just like anything else inside there, there's going to be a, a uh, camera and a, um, a camera and a, a CMOS sensor. So we'll go ahead and open this up. We'll put the battery in it. Just to get that out of the way. So that just opens up like that. And we'll see which way this battery goes in. Okay, so there's this little pull tab in here. This helps you get your battery out. And it goes down like this. Like that. And there the blue comes on. Now it's an LED, it's not a laser in this mouse. <coughs> so you can see it's got a nice chrome bezel around here. It's all lit up blue. It's kind of neat. I've read it says it fades after a little while once it acquires a signal. So you've, this is your standard mouse. You get the scroll wheel, click left and right, uh, the normal clicks. And on this, they left this off their last models. This is a forward and back button or whatever else you want to assign them for. That's real handy to have here. Um, as far as like this last generation mouse, or they still sell this, but 
you can see you've got your normal clicks and the, the traditional scroll wheel they went to that's real smooth. Um, they only have one button here. I prefer two. It just makes it easier for back forward. That's what I know, tend to assign them to. So in here you have another button on this side. And uh, you can see this mouse is it's kind of hard to hold. They're slippery. Um, this mouse is a little bit wider. Looks like it might be a little more comfortable. Depends on the size hands you have. For me, uh, it, the bigger the better in this case. So, uh, but the mouse, the mouse wheel feels feels just about the same. It actually moves a little bit easier on the blue track.